articulate, motivational, informative, powerful. Meet the woman who has inspired the lives of many all across the country with her unique style of speaking. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, the five, motivational four, spark three, into two, the one. new millennium. She is Patricia Russell McLeod, a national award-winning, highly acclaimed motivational speaker and orator, an attorney certified to practice before the United States Supreme Court, one of top five business motivators in America, according to Black Enterprise Magazine, and one of 10 best speakers in America as identified by George Frazier, author of Success Runs in Our Race. But most of all, Patricia Russell McLeod is a visual speaking experience. The mind is an electrical chemical reduction plant that's integrated with segregated states of special energy extracts with storage batteries. The mind has 62,000 miles of capillaries with a whole extraordinary complex mechanism. It's guided with exquisite precision. It has a telescopic and a microscopic range finder. It has a spectroscope with a main fuel intake and exhaust system. So may I suggest to you that the mind is a terrible thing to waste. Her signature is an atypical style. She's humorous, but yet sincere. I was in charge, finally in charge, of my government agency. And then one of my senior managing attorneys came up to me and he said, I'd rather work for a woman than work for a black. And I said, and which one did you think was going to change? <laughs> when Patricia Russell McLeod develops a speech, it's original and commands attention. The X's and the O's. Have you ever felt that you were an X or an O? The X represents the majority and the O's represent the minority and it really doesn't matter who you are or how you are as an individual. It just depends upon how you're being classified or categorized in a particular situation. The O's seem different just because there are so few of them when compared to the exes. Have you ever felt different? Patricia Russell McLeod's unique oratorical style makes her unforgettable. You are not parenthetical. You're not an afterthought. You're not an add-on. I am suggesting you individually and collectively on a scale of 1 to 10 and 10 is high, you're at least 350. Patricia Russell McLeod has dazzled audiences with many of her popular speeches, such as, if not you, who? If not now, when? Vision 2000, celebrate the differences. And the elevator to success is not running. You must take the stairs. Patricia Russell McLeod has received many rave reviews. The state of Georgia credits her support and imagination for their level of success. The University of Illinois Alumni Association was inspired and held captive by her speech. The National Black McDonald's Operations Association was in awe, and she rocked the house in Birmingham at the North Central Alabama Sickle Cell Foundation. From Tennessee Valley to upstate New York, corporations have reveled in the atmosphere that Patricia Russell McLeod has created. You're the best that we've got. You're the best. But when you have Uno number one first place, you have to push to keep first place going to take all of us. It's going to take the men and the women. It's going to take all of the races, ethnic backgrounds, ages and lifestyles. It's going to take all of us working together for the common good. In other words, we may not have it all together, but together we can have it all. Patricia Russell McLeod is also the author of A is for Attitude, an alphabet for living, which gives the recipe for living alphabetically. M is for meditation. Take time to get to know who you are. And N is for now. For now is the hour. And O is for the opportunity to make a difference. And P is for the promise that you hold for generations yet unborn. And Q is for the questions that you must always be willing to ask. R is for the roots. For as a twig is bent, so shall it grow. And S is for survival. And it really will be the survival of the fittest. T is for the truth that you must be willing to tell. And U is for the unity that we must achieve. V is for the vision. Never lose sight of the top of the mountain and W is for the willpower to rise to the top of the crop. X is for x-ray. Hold people, persons, and things up to the light. Y is for you and your contribution and Z is for the zodiac and your place in the sun. 
Patricia Russell McLeod has extended her skills to the theater, receiving critical acclaim for her one-woman show, Keep Rising, a theatrical work that follows the life stages of an African-American woman. You can still keep rising. Keep rising. Keep rising. Keep Rising is designed to portray an African-American woman's life from a little girl all the way through the episodic uh, pathway that it necessarily takes. What it really relates to is that girlfriend wanted you to have you to believe that you live downtown and not across town and so there was no expectation of your excellence and achievement that you could succeed against the odds, that you could turn stumbling blocks into stepping stones and obstacles into opportunities. Rising has been used for fundraisers and has been sponsored by companies such as Coca-Cola, Michigan State, and Eli Lilly. <laughs> Patricia Russell McLeod has been called a motivational guru. She's been featured in Ebony Magazine, Essence Magazine, and Black Enterprise. She's also well-versed on subjects such as education and diversity. Because knowledge is power. And information is a positive response to a negative threat. And ignorance is not bliss. It is housing a mind that knows more. It is going in the workplace and being able to take your place, knowing that you can give and take direction. Potential. Diversity is not scheduling Brotherhood Week a unity month, a women's month, and saying we have diversity. It is not to say that we're going to have favoritism over fitness. It is going to simply say that we are going to get past the generalizations and prejudgments and the stereotypic portrayals and the censor perceptions. It's going to say that we look at change. Change is a constant. The only thing that remains the same is change. Now there's good news and bad news about change. The good news is people resist change. And the bad news is people resist change. Empower your organization now. 